Hey, what's up? I'm Jeff Haynes from Tech Bargains, and this is the video review of the HP ZR2440W 24-inch LED backlit IPS monitor. Now that we're in the 21st century, we no longer have to rely upon the bulky, cumbersome, desk-eating CRT displays of old. Instead, we can look forward to the slimmer, faster, and sharper LED screens of now. And depending upon your needs, an IPS monitor might be exactly what's right for you, because it offers wider viewing angles, sharper accuracy, and a larger color palette. That's especially important for designers, artists, and some users that need higher graphical fidelity. HP believes that it has the perfect monitor for these performance-driven users with the ZR2440W. So here are our thoughts on this particular monitor. The ZR2440W is a 24.1-inch widescreen display with a native resolution of 1920 by 1200, giving the monitor a 16 by 10 aspect ratio. The system boasts a viewing angle up to 178 degrees, both horizontally and vertically, and it packs a brightness level that ranges between 50 and 350 nits. The display comes with a 1,000 to 1 static contrast ratio and a 2 million to 1 dynamic contrast ratio, as well as a response time of 6 milliseconds. Rounding out some of the features of the monitor are DisplayPort, DVI-D, and HDMI video inputs, as well as four USB 2.0 ports. The first thing that we noticed about the monitor is that it's incredibly easy to set up right out of the box to its stand, meaning you can be up and running with the display in minutes. Align the monitor, press the release button, and slide it into place and you're ready to go. It also has a small panel in the base of the stand to allow you to run cables from the rear of the system to the input-output panel on the monitor. On top of that, the stand helps with finding the perfect angle for viewing content by allowing users to pivot, tilt, swivel, and adjust the height of the display, ensuring that you can view the screen in the best possible way. Additionally, we appreciated that HP decided to include a number of inputs for the machine. For instance, we appreciated the inclusion of DVI, HDMI, and display ports to make sure that we had numerous ways to connect the monitor to our test systems. We were also pleased that the monitor provided a few extra USB ports because it's surprisingly easy to run out of ports when you're using a lot of peripherals. Now, we liked the choice by HP to make the ZR2440W an IPS display. Graphics professionals rely upon the wide viewing angles, heightened color gamut, and accuracy of these kinds of monitors. We found that the ZR2440W presents on-screen content sharply, and it's enhanced by its refresh rate to present content faithfully. We noticed that all our work and our play was quite sharp and vibrant, so the attention to visual fidelity did help in this respect. HP also clearly spent attention to what users might need for a catastrophic circumstance with the monitor. For one thing, it has a slide-out information tab where a user can reach up and read service information on the card to the HP customer rep on the other side of the phone. On top of that, the monitor comes with a full three-year warranty in case you have any issues with it, which is much better than the standard one-year warranty found on a lot of comparable displays. We ran the ZR2440W through a number of tests and calibrations, including a color gradient test. Unfortunately, it displayed a pattern of horizontal banding through the color gradient, which occurred regardless of whether we switched inputs on the monitor or even switched out test computers. We also noticed the same kind of banding on some images and graphics as well. Having ruled out the inputs as well as the video cards, the only thing we could come up with was an issue with the monitor itself that seemed to be creating its own artifacts or gradients, complicating its effectiveness for visual professionals. Another problem we had was that while the viewing angle was better than some of the twisted pneumatic panels we've seen, the brightness dropped significantly as soon as you moved around 45 degrees away from the center of the monitor, as well as a few inches vertically at a normal viewing distance. Now if you move farther away, you get a slightly better angle for the screen, but the brightness issues are still there. That's a bit disappointing because most IPS monitors are fantastic in its viewing angles. This one unfortunately wasn't. We also were a bit disappointed by the USB ports included with the monitor. While we appreciate the extra ports, they're all USB 2.0 instead of the USB 3.0 ports that have become the industry standard. Considering that HP is marketing this monitor as a premium device, it really should have had at least one 3.0 port included as a minimum. That's especially true if HP wants to justify the additional premium price it's charging for the ZR2440W. We managed to find the same size of IPS monitor with similar specs and warranty for at least 20% less online, making it a bit harder to prove why it's worth it to pay extra. The ZR2440W is a monitor that's easy to adjust and set up, and it comes with plenty of inputs and ports. Unfortunately, this display has a high premium price, but it doesn't always showcase premium performance. 
The viewing angles aren't great once you move away from the center of the screen, the USB ports are outdated, and the horizontal banding will cause serious issues for visual pros. It might be fine for everyday use, but what should showcase the monitor's strengths actually demonstrates its weaknesses. For these reasons, we decided to give the HP ZR2440W a 2.5 out of 5. For the latest coupons and deals on monitors from HP, make sure you check out techbargains.com HP. To enter our monthly giveaway, make sure you always check out techbargains.com YouTube. And to watch our video unboxings, video reviews, and exclusive video features, make sure to check out techbargains.com videos.